Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have the Cave Club Series 1 Roar Lie to review with you guys. So let's get started and look at the box. So I've already gotten her out of the box. The box is super simple to open. I like that. So you just pull that out and then there you go. So here's the name of her pet and then her name at the top. And then it has this cute little embedded rock detailing around the box itself. And then of course the Cave Club logo. And then it's by Mattel. And then on the back we have a cute illustration of Warlai. And then it tells you about what the Cave Club is about. And that's pretty much it. So now on to the doll. So here she is. She's so cute. Um, one of my favorites. I like her. She's got this... Um, beautiful face with these um, white marks under her eyes that look like cat whiskers almost. I love that. And then of course her triangles over her eyes and then her beautiful green eyes and minimum makeup. And then she has this purple line over her nose, pink lips, and then her eye brows are this lilac color with purple lines to show the hairs and her hair is this dark purple not really dark purple i don't know what kind of purple fuchsia yeah maybe fuchsia fuchsia colored hair and it's just long and then it has this top knot at the top which is crimped i love that and then she has this rib cage here in her hair to show it's a little cat-like stuff because she's she is a cat girl um if you guys didn't know Lorelai here was raised by saber tooth tigers so she doesn't know who her parents are she just knows that her family is a cat family and then she has her little teeth here in her belt satchel and then she has this fur collar detail which is removable so it's two pieces so she does have three pieces um she's got this skirt and then she has the little shirt and then this part right here which is the shawl and the shirt has like this leopard print and then the dress skirt thing because it does have a shoulder right here it is this tiger print with different rainbow colors super cute and then on her feet I love this detail I don't know why people don't like it but I do because they're not gonna wear shoes so they have leg warmers so they're furry leg warmers that she wears around her feet I like that it gives it more of a cave feel and her hair is not the best quality it is this nasty nylon yuck hate that but I don't really mind it on these type of dolls they're just cute and they have this cutesy big little face and their ears are super big because they're little cave people and I love that and then her accessories she came with a bone comb which you can put in her hair or comb it and she also came with a um, saber tooth tiger purse right here and it actually has a headband attached to it which you can put in her hair and she did come with a pet but I don't know where it went. Goodness, I lost it. Does it show on the back? No. Well, her pet's name is Feral, and it's a... Oh, wait, here it is. Oh, found it. Okay. Here it is. Her pet is a saber-toothed tiger cub. I don't think... It, it might not even be her pet, if you think about it. If she's raised by them, it could be like her little sibling... So it might be like her little sibling here. So this is a saber tooth tiger cat. And it's purple. And it matches her purple motif. And it does have this nice articulation where it can rotate at the head. And it has the same green eyes that she has. And a little kitty paw up. And her articulation, she can move her head from side to side. Cannot look up or down. Her arms can go out and in at the shoulder 
and she has elbow articulation and wrist articulation and knee articulation. I love that. So I really, really like this line. I really hope they continue because I do like this line a lot. I need to get the others in the series. My next one I want to get is Tella because I have Slate, which is her brother. So yeah, each of the dolls has their own unique personality dash thing about them. Like I said, she is the Sabretooth cat girl. And then Slate is the artist and um, Tella, her, his sister, is the girl that sees the future. And then we have Vanessa, who is the plant girl who loves plants and animals. And then we have um, Emberly, who likes to invent things. So she always invents things and um, invented fire. So that's really cool. So each one has their own unique thing. So yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you're new here, please feel free to hit the subscribe button. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thumbs up if you like videos like these. And I will see you next time. Bye.